very, very uh, proud of this this program. Um, just a another great moment in our time here. Kind of just continuing to build on what um, the great players of our past have have uh, done. So um, really cool. Uh, I think we played very well all weekend long. Uh, made some really nice plays. Pitched very well, and obviously. Uh, really starting to be the offensive force that I thought this team could be. And uh, I told Jeff in about the third inning after we scored five, I said, Jeff, you're doing a, an amazing job with this this offense. And this is by far the best that we have been dialed in in our time here. And um, it's, just, it's just really cool to see. So very, very proud of our fans, um, our administration, the support that we continue to get from my first day here when we weren't very good. Um, the support has been the exact same from our sport administrator, Jesse Martin, who's here every single day, who's lived every single pitch of this, every everything. And it's just been really cool. So just very thankful for kids like this who took a chance on, on OSU, and, and um, it's really cool. Um, I remember I was thinking there in the last inning how – it's crazy how much the dynamic here has changed and the mentality because I remember how uh, excited and crazy we were after regionals uh, a couple years ago to win it, and now it's just expected. So it's kind of cool to see that change over time. Um, just really proud of everybody. I think we're uh, headed in the right direction. But I just think we knew that we didn't play our best, uh, the Big 12 tournament. I think we were a little tired, you know, going into that second day. But uh, we were pumped. We were ready. We kind of took a team retreat and just uh, stayed together and bonded a lot. And I think our chemistry this, these last few weeks have pushed us to win a lot of games. So, uh, yeah, we were really excited about our matchups this weekend. And then it's been fun uh, ever since. So, Yeah, and I think the crowd, uh, I mean, we, we feed off this crowd. It was weird. It was kind of... I thought the start of this game, it was kind of eerily quiet. Um, I felt that a little bit in the dugout. Um, I was trying to kind of, I was just kind of watching, just kind of listening. Both teams were quiet. I don't know if it was like you weren't sure if the game was going to start because of rain. I don't sure. I'm not sure if that's a little bit of nerves, to be very honest. I mean, I, I know I woke up this morning way before my alarm clock. Um, yeah, I usually do, but I was really early today. Um, kind of like antsy, you know, just had that antsy type deal. I couldn't sit still in my office. And then the rain comes and I'm like, dang it, you know, we've done so much. And and now, you know, is it going to drive the crowd away? And it was kind of a sparse to start out with. And then it just started filling up. And, I, don't, you know, it's Sunday. It's hard on a Sunday at 1 o'clock. There's rain. But, man, as we got going there and we hit the first home run, I was like, uh-oh, they're, they're, they are here. And all weekend long, I can't say enough about our fans. Can't say enough about the deck out there, the people in the seats. Um, you know, if we didn't have COVID, we, we'd have people down those lines. It'd be nuts. And um, just so thankful that we were at home. I mean, we, we earned that. So I'm not, it's not like we got handed a gift. We earned that. And that's what you get when you play at home. And I think we have as good of atmosphere anywhere. Uh, I know that Alabama is really good and LSU is really good. But man, this is really good for what we have. For our limitations, this is as good as it gets. For more information, you can visit TulsaWorld.com.